Uh, Johnson's exit plan is, is four months long. What are the experts saying when it comes to whether or not that'll allow enough time between the different phases to actually do this safely? Good to be with you, uh, Tim. The Prime Minister characterising the four-stage approach as being cautious and irreversible. He doesn't want to plunge the UK into another national lockdown. And that is really the thinking behind uh, this long reopening over the course of four months, weeks between the different stages. A lot of experts applauding that because it will give time uh, for the government, for scientists to assess the impact of these reopenings on infection levels and of course on hospitalizations you mentioned they're beginning from next month March the 8th with schools going back the focus being on uh, returning students to education we'll also see some out or contact allowed uh, in the beginning of March and towards the end of March uh, some more uh, 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 outdoor gatherings allowed as well as we return get to April a few weeks after we've seen schools go back we're going to see retail uh, being allowed to reopen uh, also personal care so hairdressers uh, gyms they'll also be allowed to reopen from April and if things continue as the government expect it to by May we'll start seeing some indoor hospitality being allowed to mm. reopen and the idea of course by the end of of June uh, that all restrictions on social meetups and gatherings will have been lifted. The biggest stories the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.